Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. We have over here grade three and grade four from St Aloysius Kingston. Welcome grade three and grade four. So, boys and girls, my name is Mr Gill. Good morning, everybody. Hands up if you are in grade three. Hands up if you're in grade four. Hands down, thank you. Tell me one thing we are going to do this morning. And when you put your hands up, tell me your name. Yes, what's your name? Erica. Erica, what are we going to do, Erica? Sing. Sing, correct, Erica, we're going to sing. Thank you. What else are we going to do? Yes. Um, listen to music. Listen to music. What's your name? Paige. Paige said listen. Can you say listen? Listen. Why is listening important? Yes, what's your name? Alice. Alice. Why is listening important, Alice? If you don't listen, if you, don't listen um, you won't learn. learn. Thank you, Alice. Alice has just given us a good phrase. If you don't listen, you won't learn. Say that. If you don't listen, you won't learn. If you don't listen, you won't learn. If you don't listen, you won't learn. I'm going to ask Mr. Wayne if you would give us bomb, bomb, bomb on a wood bomb, Mr. Wayne, that would be fun. Today we'll listen. We'll listen to the music. We'll sing some songs. Give Mr. Wayne a big clap for that beautiful playing there. What was the instrument Mr. Wayne was playing? It was that, yes? Would you like to play the woodblock? What's your name? Taylor, would you like to play the woodblock? Okay, come on, Mr. Wayne, may Taylor play the woodblock? Go up there, Taylor. <clears throat> Mr. Wayne will show you exactly what to do. And off you go, Taylor. And we're going to go pop. Bop, bop, bop. While Taylor's doing that, keep going, Taylor. I'm going to give you some patterns and I want you to clap them back. Here they are, listening. Give Taylor a big clap for that beautiful playing on the woodblock. <clears throat> now, is there anybody else who'd like to play the woodblock? Because I've got a surprise for the orchestra. It will be a boy. What's your name? Marcus. Come on, Marcus. You go and play the woodblock. Now, what's going to happen is this. I'm going to clap a pattern. Then I'm going to ask a member of the orchestra to make up a tune based on that pattern. Who would like to do that, Hiato? Sure. Very good. <laughs> Here we go. So, let's have your pattern, Marcus. Just keep going, that beautiful pulse. So I'm going to clap a pattern. Then here's the alto, and he's going to play something on the violin for us, making it up. Keep going, Marcus. Give both of our players, Marcus and Yato, a very big clap. <clears throat> okay, Marcus, thank you very much. Now, yes, do you want to have a go? Okay, what's your name? Sorry? Connor, okay, Connor, you can have a go. Let's change the instruments. Can we go to the tambourine? Do you want to play the tambourine, Connor? I'd say that's a yes. So, here we go. Connor, I'm going to give you a pattern and play it when we've... So it goes like this. My pattern, Connor listens and repeats. Who do you listen to? Me and Connor. Then I'm going to nominate a player in the orchestra to make up a tune. Here we go, here's my pattern, Connor. <laughs> da, da, da. Can you clap that? Mr. Nuttall. 
Would you play a tune to that rhythm? How appropriate. Let's give Mr. Nuttall and Connor a big clap for their beautiful play. Okay, thank you very much. And last person who'd like to go to be a girl. Okay. With a tambourine. <clears throat> now, here we go. And here's our pattern. Us. Joseph, could you make a tune up to that pattern? <laughs> Can you sing Joseph's tune? And la, 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 la. Beautiful. Very good listening, you guys. Thank you very much. Now I'm going to ask Eleanor if she would tune the orchestra. Stand up, guys, so you can see. Look right into the orchestra and listen as they tune. Okay, guys, you may sit down. Thank you very much. Now, as you were looking then at the orchestra, hands up if you recognise some instruments that you would know the names of. Hands up, yes. Violins. Let's ask all the violins to stand up. We'll see with all the violins. There they are. Thank you, violins. Who recognise other instruments apart from violins? Yes. The bass. There they are. The bass is right down there. Thank you. What else do we recognise? But yes, Alice. Um, Which one? Tubers. tubers. Okay. Now, could we hold the tuba mute up? Can we have the tuba mute? Because we're on the right track. I know where we're coming from. There's the, That's some of the tuba, Alice. That's the tuba mute. But I wonder if the trombones would stand up and the trumpets because. You all come from the same Latin word. So there we are. Are they the instruments you're thinking of, Alice? Yes, thank you very much. And? A cello. A cello. Let's have a look at the cellos. Cellos are over here. There they are. Yes. The harp. Let's hear something from the harp, Bronwyn. Maybe hear something from the harp. Give Bronwyn a clap for that beautiful play. Thank you. <clears throat> what about over here? What are the instruments sitting right here? These instruments here. Yes. Horns. Exactly. Very good. And what about, I wonder if the wind players would stand up. What do you see there in the wind players? Yes. Flutes. Let's hear something from the flute. Thank you, Mr. Mackey. So we heard the flute. Thank you, flutes. You may sit down. And who else is there in the wind players? Yeah. The clarinets, let's hear something. Both clarinets, feel free to go crazy. Here we go. And. Give the clarinets a big clap. It's beautiful playing, thank you. And right next to the clarinets, who's next to the clarinets? Let's hear the bassoons playing something, please. So what did I say that where they were? Bassoons, can you say bassoons? Let's clap for Suze. The Suze. The Suze can sit down. Thank you very much. Who's left? We've heard one. We've heard them this morning once. Yeah. Pardon? The drums are up here. That's right. They're, that's, they're still... We, we sort of heard some of them. But who are these people here? Dinah and David. Yeah. Sorry? Piccolos. Piccolos? Is that what you said? You are so... What's your name? Zach. Zach. Would the piccolo stand up, please? There's the piccolo. See how close you are, Zach? Let's hear something on the piccolo. Can 
Give the pick another clap for that beautiful plane. So, Zach, you're on the right track. You're in the right area. We just need to find, I'll give you a, yes. Oboes, what's your name? Will. Will, Oboes, correct. Let's hear something Oboes, we already have, but it's always good to refresh. Ant. Thank you very much, Oboes. Okay, now. We're going to play a piece for you, and I'm not going to tell you anything about the piece at all. I want you to listen, and then I have some questions, and we're going to have an opportunity to sing something from the piece. So just listen to this first. Here we go. This is the Rimsky Korsakoff, please. Yeah, the Adagio. Children, this is a little bit, probably a bit naughty of me, but I'm going to do this. Just stand. Now, walk very quietly down here and stand and come across the, and stand in front of the orchestra so you can really see into the orchestra. They're all coming over here now, that's good. So, beautiful. Okay. Um.
Let's give the orchestra a big clap for their play. <clears throat> okay, now, so tell me something you noticed about that. Anything at all you noticed about the music? What did you notice, Zach? Um, I the violins, they certainly played. Good. Anything? Yes, over here. Yes, Alice, what did you notice? You heard the? Yeah. These instruments right in front of you, did you hear those instruments? Yes, they, what are they called? Yeah. Um, uh, They're the? Yes. The basses. the basses, that's right. But you were going to say something else, weren't you? Um, I heard the tubers. The, okay, they're actually called trombones. Okay, so we should clear that up on straight away. Guys, <laughs> let's say trombones. In fact, trombones, let's go from letter, where you play the lovely sound, letter D. Let's hear the trombones, guys, at letter D. Here we go. And one. Let's see if you can clap with the trombones while they play. Here we go. Let's get a minute. clap what the trombones play. Here we go. And one. Good people. Thank you, trombones. What else did you hear over on this side? Yeah. Anyone on this side? Yes. It was loud and quiet. It was loud and quiet. Good. Yes. It went louder and it went lower. It went louder and lower. Let's talk about louder and lower. Let's go to the beginning, ladies and gentlemen. Okay? Now, we're going to play the very beginning. Tell me what you notice. Now, are you quite happy to stand here, teachers? Is that okay for them to be standing here? Because it's good for us, yeah? Here we go. Look, we're going to start at the beginning of the piece and tell me what you notice. Here we go. And one. So who plays at the beginning? Who plays at the beginning? Yeah. Cellos. The cellos and, yes, the bass and anybody else? Is there anybody else playing? Yes. The violins. Did you see the violins play at the beginning? Let me check. We'll do it again. Here we go. Let's check. We'll just do that over here again. Have a look and see if the violins are playing. And one. Were the violins playing? No, it's okay. They want to, but they're not allowed. <laughs> they're not going to play. Okay. Yes. Um, what's the instrument up at the, that one? The one up the back. Yes. Yeah, what's your name? Ethan, that's right, Ethan. What, who remembers the name of these instruments? Yes. Bassoons. Bassoons. Let's say that, guys. Bassoons. Say it. Bassoons. Clap it. And bassoons. Now, let's listen to what the bassoons do. Here we go. And one. What can you say about that bassoon tune? Yes. It's a pattern, thank you very much. What else can we say about the tune? Yes. It's really low. It's really low, very good. Something else about the bassoon tune? Yes. It's? It sounds mysterious, thank you. Any other ideas about the bassoon tune? Okay, let's listen to the cellos. Here we go. And one. Now let's listen to the bassoons and one. What could you say about the cello tune and the bassoon tune? Yes, Zach? They're both not very fast. They're both not very fast, thank you. Anything else? Yes? They're both different. Ah, so how are they different, Ethan? Um, that one sounds a bit lower and that one's a bit higher. Okay, we're on, let's have, let's have another listen. Let's, hit, let's have them together. And one. <laughs> Okay, what do you think? Um, I'm not sure. Not sure. Good. Not sure is okay. Yes. I think they sound um, the same. You think they sound the same. What's your name? Bryn. Bryn. Who agrees with Bryn? Bryn thinks they sound the same. Look, Bryn, you've got friends in the orchestra. How many orchestral players think they sound the same? Some are not sure, but that's okay. <laughs> <clears throat> You're right, Bryn. They sound the same. 
Now, let's hear it with the basses. Here we go. Basses, bassoons and cellos, and one. Thank you very much. What do you notice about the bass tune, Zach? It's louder tune. It's louder. Thank you. Something else about the bass tune. <laughs> yes, it's, yes. It's lower. Who said that? Who is that? Alice. It's lower. Good, Alice. Let's hear the basses. Ready? And one. It's lower. Correct. Now, yes. It's part of the strings. Thank you very much. Now, here's the test. We're going to close our eyes, and I'm going to ask one of the instruments, the basses, the cellos, or the bassoons to play, and you have to tell me which one it was. Eyes closed, hands over eyes. Here we go. And eyes open. Which is was it? Um, uh, bassoon. The bassoons, that's right. Who agrees it was the bassoons? Hands up. Well done. Eyes closed, eyes closed. And here we go. Yes? It was the bassoons again, that's right, here we go. And now this time, this one, and eyes open, who was, yes? The bass, who agrees with bass? Yes, good, and this time, here we go. Eyes open, yes, Emma. The cellos, is it Emma? Erica. Erica, the cellos, very good. Now, this time, Close eyes. I'm going to ask two instruments to play. Tell me which two are playing, which groups. Eyes closed. Eyes open. And Bryn? Cello and bass. Cello and bass. Who's with Bryn for cello and bass? Okay. Yes. Who, who's got a different idea? Yes. Yes, cello and bassoon. What's your name? Zoe. Zoe, cello and bassoon. Who's with Zoe? Cello and bassoon. I am. Very good. Okay. This time, here we go. Last one. Eyes closed. And who was it then? <laughs> Connor. <laughs> the bassoon and the bass. Who's with Connor on that one? Very good. Okay, let's go on. Wendy, would you play something for us at letter A? Listen to Wendy at letter A. Here we go. Hands ready to conduct and sing with Wendy. One and two and... Did you hear the orchestra singing? Yes. They were beautiful, weren't they? Were you singing too? Yes. yes. Were you? Yes, yes. Okay, let me hear. Okay, I want to hear saying Aloysius sing. No orchestra this time. Thank you. Just Aloysius and Wendy. And. Beautiful. Can we go out to see, ladies and gentlemen? Let's. Tell me what's happening here. <coughs> and let us see, please. And. So, what do you hear there? Which instruments are playing? Yes, Connor? The violin. What are the, what's the violin doing? The... Let's listen to the violins and let us see. Everyone listening to the violins and let us see. And. So what are the violins doing? Yes, right up there. Yeah. Pulling their strings with their, yes, with the bow. And what are the, these violins here doing? 
What do we call that? Who knows what the word is for that? Can we hear that sound again, please, seconds? And. Ethan? Pardon? Cellos. They're not the cellos. The cellos are right there. Okay? You've just alienated four close friends in one move. <laughs> All right? Okay. So, let, who knows what that, that sound is that the violin's making? Yes. Um, plucking. plucking. Very good. Let's see who else plucks. Let's have all the strings and see who else plucks. All the strings at C. Who else is plucking? And. Okay, who else is plucking, Ethan? Ah, oh, they're friends again. All right, so <laughs> now, what's the word? Who knows the word for plucking? What, there's an Italian expression for plucking. It's pizzicato. Can you say pizzicato? pizzicato? Now, let's see who isn't playing pizzicato. So everyone not playing pizzicato. Here we go. And let's see. And. So who's playing at that particular part? Yes. The violins are playing. And what about these instruments here? What are they called? Who knows the answer? The, the, yes. Viola. Viola. Very good. What's your name? Anna. Anna. It's viola. Say viola. viola. Stand up, violas, please. The violas are very special. <laughs> they really are. They're the beautiful, beautiful colour. So they've got something different from all the other strings. Let's listen again. Here we go. And right on C. And. So we put all the strings together and tell me what's special about the violas. Here we go. And. What's special about the violas? Yes. They're louder and slower. They're louder and slower. Good. <clears throat> Something else. Yes. <laughs> That's not a comment, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> That's right here, Erica, though. You're absolutely right. They're louder. And something else. Yes. They're playing the melody. That's right. So what do we call what these other people are doing? They are? Plucking and they are accompanying. Say accompanying. Accompanying. Very good. Here we go. C. And we'll go on. And. Thank you. Can we all jump to the five A's at D, please? Here we go. The five A's at D. Listen to this. And. So, what happens in the music there? What happens in the music? Yes, Connor? It goes higher. Higher and? Higher and louder. louder. Okay. Who who makes who helps the orchestra make it loud? Yes. The string family. Are the, string family doing? the string family. Let's see what the string family is doing at that five eight. Here we go. And. Now, another group of instruments plays exactly that. So, could we have that other group of instruments at the 5-8? Thank you. And one. So, who didn't play then? Who didn't play? We had, who was that, that group of instruments that played then? What was that group? Yes. Um, Woodwind. Exactly. Thank you, Zach. So, let's listen to the brass at that section. Here we go. And one. So we put that all together. Here we go. And one. Now, grade three and four, you have been seriously, seriously good listeners. And we're really going to town on this piece. This is the last bit with this piece. And if we can work this out, 
we'll have done something really interesting. So we're going to go on, ladies and gentlemen, to one, two, through the fifth bar of the 5 8, where the seconds lead. And we're listening principally to the strings. We're listening mainly to the strings. Here we go. And. So what did you notice about what the strings did then? Yes, Erica? It started with a couple, then added on. Started with a couple, then added on. Very good. We're going to start with the seconds. Put your hands up when you hear the add-on start. We're going to work out who adds on. Here we go. And, thank you, seconds. And one. Thank you. So who, who comes in? The, the upper violins. That's right, the first violins. Who agrees first violins? Let's, okay, then who comes in after the first violins? Here we go. We're going to start with the seconds. Then we're going to hear the first and find out who comes in then. Here we go. Thank you, seconds. One. Who comes in then? Yes. The basses and? The cellos. The cellos, exactly. Let's give our orchestra a big clap for their beautiful playing of that piece.